Oh, 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 they are showing that hook. Hey, hey, that was a good hook in the exchange. Ooh, he knocked the snot bubbles. That, hey, that was a good 12th round, dog. That was a good 12th. Lubin just need to tighten up a little bit. Ooh, they showing that he knocked the sweat. He knocked the sweat. Snot. Shoosh. Hey, Goucher is hard to fight, man, due to that amateur experience he got. And see, this is what I'm talking about. Look at those numbers. Goucher didn't throw enough jabs, dog. Look. He didn't throw enough jabs, man. You got to throw more jabs than that, dog. You got to throw more jabs, dog. You got to throw more jabs, man. You got to throw way more jabs. You can't be... You got to jab more, dog. You got to jab more. You can't win a fight by not jabbing. That's why the jab is important. Another thing, too... Another thing is... um. You got to know how to bend your knees. I'm starting to see like a lot. People got to bend their knees, man. You standing too straight up and it's hard for you to really dig with your full shots to the guts. So you definitely want to bend your knees, use the jab, use um, your feints and have head movement. It all really starts with those fundamentals. Head movement, jab, feints, bending your knees. Everything come off that, even the defense, dog, I'm telling you. Start listening. That was a good fight by Erickson Lubin. He fought a hard fight against um, Terrell Goucher. That's a fight that'll get him ready for a Charlo. You know what I mean? I feel like Lubin got to be more, um, he need to be more tight with his D. Keeping his hands closer to the chin at home so he don't get hit. And, and like another thing too, a lot of y'all fighters, y'all don't open up y'all glove. You gotta open up the hand in the glove. That's what, you know what, I ain't gonna say that because I'm giving away too many gems. Shout out to my man, gems in gems at the gym or whatever. I'll be watching this podcast too, the man gems. He be having some, some, good, um, some good insight on battle rap. But I really feel like Terrell Goucher could have um, threw more shots, let the jab go. Um, that's a lot of things we already talk about on my channel, but hey, it's boxing is it's hard. But I really feel, listen, he still get the bars though. Technically, bending your knees, moving your head from side to side, changing levels up and down, up, down, up, down. You see how I change levels and moving your head east, west, east. West, that will help you create angles. The head movement creates the angle. These are boxing bars, boxing and bars. And if you don't have your bars together with boxing, you will be in a box not saying no bars. Listen, that was a good fight. It was a decent fight. He just couldn't get off. Like he gotta, listen, the, the easiest way to learn how to get off is improving your defense. That's it. One, we out.